Another drill I like to cover today is called the fast read drill. The purpose of the fast read drill is to teach the linebacker proper run fit technique versus fast read or outside run plays. Uh, the main coaching point emphasis is to teach the linebacker how to properly press the line of scrimmage with good good pad level. When we when we do this drill, the drill is set up where we have uh, three uh, linebackers in and they're simulating the center and the guard. And then what we do, uh, we have a running back there and he will go either to his left or right. Uh, the coach now is, is set up behind the two linebackers. Both linebackers are lined up over the guys that's, that's based on being the guard. And then now as a coach, I will signal, uh, either give them a signal to block to the left or to the right. Uh, whatever side I go, the guard will now loop around the can, stay square, and then that front side linebacker, the point, the coaching point we uh, emphasize is that, is that he must fit on a block inside out to avoid creating a cutback lane. So it's proper now. When he enter, he has to enter with his face in the hand. He want to rub his rib together. He want to take on that block, get his eyes inside nice and tight, get his feet in the backfield, and drive that, uh, drive that block back so then now we could try to eat up too. And then now the backside linebacker, once he get his proper read, then now he wants to run and rip. And then now as he run and rip, he want to scrape for skin on the front side linebacker. So tight we use the term that if the, he could steal his wallet. So if that front side linebacker 59 or 52, wherever, based on where the ball is going, he fits the backside linebacker, wants to scrape for skin so tight that he could steal his wallet. And then now he want to run the banana and go upfield. He want to run like a banana and curl, and curl uh, upfield in order to make the tackle in the backfield. So the drill is set up. Both linebackers are keying, obviously, the running back, and the running back is going to tell him, tell them which side to is going to be the front side and which side is going to be the back side. It's important also that the back side linebacker, he has to mirror the path for the running back. And, and so that's a huge coach, uh, coaching point that we want to be able to get inside out, and we, we want to work inside out on a block, and it becomes an angle tackle. So it's important that we don't overrun the running back. So the drill is set up. So now, front 59 now is the front side linebacker. He's going to enter with his uh, hat in hand. Good job right here. Good job over-exaggerating, fitting his side uh, to prevent any cutback. And then now 52 now, he needs to be a little bit tighter. He's too wide. He want to be so close that he could steal a 59's wallet. Good job of ripping. All right, good job of ripping right here. Good job, good footwork, and now just want to run the banana. See, he's too wide. There's too much space in between him and the blocker. We don't want to create a cutback lanes. These running backs we're facing nowadays, they can make that cut. So as a port now, he eliminate that space in between him and him and the block. He needs to be tighter. All right, same thing, same culture point. All right, good job right here, 59. He's entering. I want to be a little bit more physical on that block. He's kind of feeling his way through. All right, 45 needs to be tighter, all right? Tighter, all right, even tighter, that's better. Good job of running banana and now getting upfield. That's the position you want to be in. You want to be in a football position to make that tackle. All right, same thing, 45 entering. See, but that's not good. He didn't enter good. It's too much space between the blocker and the can. The can represent another block. So then now, right now, that running back, he created, because of his, his angle of entering, he created a running scene right there because 59 is counting on him, you know, to eliminate that cutback lane. So then now we have the running back uh, trap. But now because he's too much space here, he's not fitting inside that block, it creates a running lane, and that's not what we want. So he's got to do, 45's got to do a better job. All right, good job. Linebackers pointing at the key. All right, good job here by 31 fitting. All right, want to get his feet in the neutral zone. All right, want to take on his block, not the block back. Good job, eyes inside. Good, better job, 44. He's there. Good job of staying square. But say, just to coach a point again, he wants to be tighter. He, he's, he's too wide away. He want to be able to, if 31 had a wallet in his, in his back pocket, he want to be tight so he can still, still uh, take his wallet out of his back pocket. So too much space in between 31 and 44. All right? Too much space with that. All right, got it again. All right, not a good good uh, uh, footwork here by 34. All right, he, he got a false step, steps backwards, 
every step count you don't want to do that in the game all right and then right now not a good not a good job of using uh his hands and and his face his face and hands he's not he's not he's not knocking his uh, uh back this uh block back and not not fitting the way i want to fit all right right here 45 Backside, all right, good step, good job here ripping, but then, all right, he wants to be tighter, but good job of running the banana, though. I like the way he entered, all right, he just need to be tighter. He needs to be straight for skin off 31 butt to put him in a better position, but I like the way he ran the banana. Now, let's take our training to the game. All right, now, this is a speed option play against Kansas State. All right, we treat that as a fast read, so 59 now has the enter. All right, he's, he has to enter, so good job of him entering. And then now 31, he does a good job. He's the rip and run guy. He's matching the path for the running back inside out. So we're stringing this play inside out. This is a huge play. We got him backed up, and, and we can't let him off the hook. Great job of making this play. Good job of swarming. Good energy, good passion. All right, the only thing, only coaching point, just want to be a little bit more inside out the ball carrier. But good job of swarming to the ball. Good job. Excellent job, and that completes our fast read drill here at the University of Miami.